Earlier this week, Governor Cuomo said that based on the current COVID trajectory, he thinks schools in New York State should fully reopen in September. News Channel 34's Karina Capabianca takes a look at the mood among teachers and school staff about a potential fall reopening. I think all of our teachers, teachers' aides, everyone is looking forward to being back in school the way it used to be. New York State United Teachers President Andy Pelota says the union supports the governor's optimism about a full return for the fall. Bob Lowry with the New York State Council of School Superintendents agrees. I think that's the uh, predominant hope among our members, school superintendents across the state, that that will be possible and, uh, and that that's, where, that's how we'll be proceeding. But both say there's a lot of details and expectations that schools will need to receive from the state before that happens. The New York State Education Department said in a statement, our hope is that as many students as possible will attend school in person this fall. We are having conversations on these issues with stakeholders and will continue to work with our partners across the state to ensure that we have the most up-to-date and reliable information possible to guide all decisions related to educating our students during the pandemic recovery. As for the use of remote instruction in the fall, NYSET would like to see that go away. Do we have a mixed bag where teachers are teaching to students in the class and also online? I haven't met one educator who thinks that's a good idea. Our hope would be that it would be very limited uh, going forward, uh, that it would not be just a straight open option, you know, open-ended option, but rather subject to some criteria. We asked the Department of Health when we might expect to see updated guidance. A spokesperson didn't give us an exact date, but said it will be forthcoming. In Albany, Karina Capabianca.